What's up guys, it's your boys Wolke back with another preview and review for a pre-order that is. We're going to be taking a look at Yu-Gi-Oh's Millennium Rod that Yami Merrick uses in Duelist Kingdom, or not Duelist Kingdom, Duel City, sorry. Um, I definitely love Merrick as a per, uh, character when it comes to Yugi. Um, I... I want, I want this. I don't know what more I, I can say. Um, when it comes to Yu-Gi-Oh, obviously there was a whole bunch of Millennium items that you could collect and so forth like that. Not many people have had actual hands-on of actual one-on-one -on -one replicas, as you will. This company, uh, Bandai Spirits, has made two different versions. Obviously, the Millennium Rod and the Millennium Puzzle. But there's a lot of uh, other things when it comes to the Millennium Necklace, the Millennium Eye, the Millennium... I, I can't even remember half of them, but this is one of my favorites from Merrick. But with that being said, grab a chair, grab some popcorn as we take an exclusive look at the this Millennium Rod for you guys to click, pre-order, and get for your guys' collection for you guys Yu-Gi-Oh fans. So with that being said, before we go any further, make sure you guys subscribe by hitting that white bar icon down at the bottom right. Hit the bell icon next to it so when I do post videos like this one, you'll get that little ring notification that's will keep myself as posted that video. Then you guys can watch, comment, like, and share. And again, thank you guys so very much for that continued love and support that you guys show on this channel every single day. I can't thank you guys enough. Keep what you guys are doing and we'll continue to keep growing. That being said, let's get into today's video. Now you guys are probably wondering why is a 35 year old man wanting to collect Yu-Gi-Oh! You know, I've been collecting Yu-Gi-Oh! for years, ever since it pretty much first came out. Day one, I bought it, my parents didn't like it, and I still kept doing it. But with that being said, I love Yu-Gi-Oh! I've collected the Funko Pops, I've collected, I actually have a tablet, a 3D tablet, Ooh, if I can get it out here, which is kind of cool, of the Pharaoh and Kaiba, Seto Kaiba, with Dark Magician and Blue Eyes, and then the three guide cards. Of the I'm, I'm a Yu-Gi-Oh fanatic, okay? Um, I actually have the, the original cards when it comes to um, the, the god cards and sort of like that. So, yeah, I'm a uh, nerd when it comes to uh, Yu-Gi-Oh. Now, this one is a complete edition exclusive to Big Bad Toy Store, another great website that I use. Now, I feel like the price is a little high due to it being plastic. I thought it was metal, but it's not. But the cool thing is, is it has um, mem memorable voice lines from the TV series, sound effects from the series and stuff like that. It features LED lights, which is kind of cool. Um, it's 16 inches long, so it definitely is the one-to-one -one hand ratio that you guys see inside the, the Battle City tournaments and stuff like that. Looking at the website, you guys can see right here, this is where it's at, Big Bad Toy Store. A great web website and company that I, I buy from a lot of the times. I'm not being sponsored by any way, so my honest opinion is my honest opinion. You can't buy that. Sorry. Um, but with that being said, this is the Millennium Rot. If you guys don't know who I'm talking about for those people that don't watch Yu-Gi-Oh, I would suggest watching Yu-Gi-Oh to start into um, Duelist Kingdom with Pegasus and then get into Battle of City and finding Merrick and his sister. And it's it's a fun time, okay? I'll tell you that right now. Up until GX, I've, I've enjoyed. After that, not so much. But again... This Yu-Gi-Oh! Millennium Rod is um, housed to Merrick, Yami Merrick, or Ishtar, um, Yami Ishtar, I should say, when he's his normal kind of sinister kind of version, but then his crazy mode is Yami Merrick, okay? Uh, <laughs> but again, the, you, everything is going to be, when you guys get this in the mail, it's going to be pretty much in a different language, just throwing that out there. Um, so for those that can't read this and so forth like that, we've had a Millennium Puzzle, but it's sold out ridiculously fast. Um, I'll post links down below, but, so in case they do become available again, but the Millennium Rod is the next, and I'm hoping they continuously make more, because there is a lot more um, pieces, so... Um, again, 16, 16 inches long, the complete edition of the Millennium Rod features the LED, LEDs and dialogue. There is the first time Rob has been released and it's featuring vacuum plating that shrines when the LEDs are in use, which is kind of cool. Um, the voice mode features both Merrick and the Darkness Merrick, so the Merrick Ishtar, Yami Merrick of the Darkness mode so you can get both lines from both personalities there are monsters summoned magic trap sounds effects whatever have you make sure to add it to your guys's collection so it's kind of cool there's a lot of people that are on tiktok nowadays that are playing Yu-Gi-Oh with dual disc which is definitely cool i wish i never would have sold my dual disc because i had both the seal of our calcos 
dual disc and the original dual disc. I'm looking at getting actually a 3D printed version of a dual disc, but making it purple because I love purple. So I'm going to make a complete actual custom dual disc. And maybe one time you'll see me on there as well, but who knows? But with that being said, the Millennium Rod can be yours. Link is in the description. It is $179, so I definitely, like I said before, it's a little high for plastic. I mean, I with the with the Millennium or the the Thanos Gauntlet, the Nano Gauntlet, Thor's Hammer, Thor's Stormbreaker. I mean, I paid $120 to $100 for those, which I think is definitely a a decent value for uh, Marvel Legends. But when it comes to Bandai Spirits and their Yu-Gi-Oh, I think 179 is a little high. I would see maybe 110 But again, I can't complain because it looks cool. <laughs> so again, thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate you guys. Again, this will not be coming out until February of 2024. So we have to wait till the new year. Links are down in the description. Again, like I said, and we'll see you guys in the next video. So keep it real, keep it safe. And as always, keep nerding on. And we'll see you guys next time.